Hello to all of you. This is Dr. Dawal Mehta and today we will understand how to run cross tabulation and chi-square using Python. For that, we will go in Jupyter Notebook. We will import pandas as pd. We will create a data frame. df is equal to pd.read underscore excel. It is an excel file and therefore we are writing here excel. r is written for the smooth import of the data file. I'm specifying the path here. Make sure that the path is in inverted commas. Then I'll run df, which will generate the data file. Now you can see here the variables which are there in our study are nationality, gender, age, handedness. All are categorical variables. Normally, cross tabulation and chi square we do when there are two categorical variables. So we want to run the cross tabs between nationality and handedness. So the command line is pd.crosstab df.nationality df.handedness. So you can see here that there are two people who are left handed in Bangladesh, zero right handed, two in China, one right handed. Two left-handed in India and one right-handed, one in USA, three right-handed. So this is a way we do the cross tabulation. Chi-square works on the frequency counts. Now we will do the cross tab between gender and handedness. So pd dot cross tab df dot sex df dot handedness, and we have got the output that in female. Two are left-handed and three are right-handed. Male, five left-handed and two right-handed. If I activate in above argument, margins is equal to true. It will give me the total on row-wise total, column total, as well as the aggregate total. Now I'll I can also keep the layers. Pd dot cross tab df dot gender that is sex square bracket df dot nationality df dot handedness margins is equal to true so i am getting the output considering three categories gender nationality and handedness and you can see here this one if i talk about this this is this is a female left handed from bangladesh similarly i can also run the pd cross tab df dot nationality df dot sex square bracket df dot handedness margins is equal to true so i'll get this type of output if i want to normalize my uh, data in the above uh, command line i will include one more argument that is normalize is equal to index and the data will get normalized if i want to find out the aggregate age according to the left hand left handed right handed and gender so I can also do th do this here. Import numpy as np. Pd dot cross tab. Df dot sex. Df dot handedness. Value is equal to df dot age. Aggregate function is np dot average. And I will get the average age of let left handed female, right handed female, left handed male, right handed male. Now I can generate the contingency table. So for that. From skypy.stats import chi square. This is chi square underscore contingency. Chi square underscore contingency. Pd dot cross tab df dot sex df dot handedness. So it will it will generate the contingency table. Now we want to run the association that is a chi square chi square between gender and handedness. So my null is there is no association between gender and handedness. And the alternative is there is association between gender and handedness. The thumb rule is if p value is more than 0 0.05, we fail to reject null hypothesis, which means that there is no association, relation, effect, influence, or impact. These words are kept reserved for regression and correlation analysis. If p value is less than 0 0.05, we reject null hypothesis, which means that there is an association between, between, between the two categorical variables. Make sure in chi-square you are using two categorical variables. 
from sky pi import steps chi square underscore steps p value degree of freedom x is equal to steps dot chi square contingency pd dot cross step df dot sex df dot handedness. Now this command we had already seen. This command we have to only insert in this chi square contingency and we will get the value of chi square. Print chi square statistics and the actual chi square statistics value. This is this is for output that I want the output in this format. Then print degree of freedom. Wait, this is for the degree of freedom. Print p value. So this is for p value. Then print the contingency table. This one. Now I got the p value here, which is 0 0.62, which is more than 0 0.05. And therefore, therefore, we fail to reject null hypothesis, which means that. There is no association between gender and handedness, which means that the left handed and right handed are equally found in males. Moreover, left handed female and left and right handed females are also equal. Those who are writing with left handed and right handed. So, this was about running the chi square in Jupyter Notebook. For more videos on data science using Python, kindly subscribe to my channel. You can follow me on LinkedIn and Twitter. Please refer my playlist in which I have already uploaded many videos which are related to data science using Python. Please don't forget to subscribe the channel and press the like button.